hello guys thanks for watching my video um after all my ncg units get their enhancements so i want to try uh bring lotus mcfina and elena to beat asura so let's see we have some missions uh deal ice water wind and dark damage to an enemy use three or more limit bursts evoke fenrir and anima mm, i need another elena okay i will okay i will borrow bow down elena because her elena set with diablo and before I introduce further about my squad and build, uh, make sure that all of your unit uh, set with anti petrify and and with ice uh, resist ice element resistance about uh, I think. 40% at least yeah at least 40% of ice res resistance okay and this is Fina as my healer and buffer because uh, she she has just get her enhancements okay and Lauren is my breaker um you can use any elemental weapons not this is just yeah i'm i put uh weapon ran randomly to her and this is elena okay uh, i will i will try i will give her main eater plus materia okay. and i bring ramza as my bravok and physical cover tanker i build him with full efficient okay so here we go let's give it a try so um, to beat this esper is kinda tricky because our attack um, most likely depends on her previous attack so we must be aware of every every her last kill that she has um this turn garnet will feel evocation go garnet will re-arise ramza and okay i okay re-arise ramza oops Sorry, um, uncoincidence. Uncons Lauren should uh, break break Asura at this turn, but yeah, I made a mistake. Okay, I will imbue water element to Elena and yeah feel a uh, limit burst go and this turn Ramza will provoke starlight and wait to blossom
Now Alvina uh, will dispel. Yeah, I think this spell is enough. And Lauren will freak. Mm, Ramza will cover. Okay, I will just use dual Aurora Tempest. Okay. Um, as you can see that um, Asura's previous attack was for second stance. That means at this turn we should not deal any attack any damage from skill magic or limit burst and also at least one unit unit guarded so um lauren guard okay i Okay, Asura's previous attack yeah, was Frozen Flame Stance. That means um, to seal her her scary skill Hexaslash Fury, we should deal we should deal fire or ice damage. So this turn I will provoke. Fenrir and I will post resistance. Okay. Oh, just dispel. And okay. Dual is enough. Dual cast. Um. Okay. Okay. Asuras. Uh, previous last attack was aurora tempest that means we should uh, deal wind or earth damage to seal her hexa slash fury um the best way to if you forget to see um what is what is asura's previous attack you can see her start if if boss resistance then you need to to deal with that uh, element that that she that she boss uh, resistant. For example, if if she boss win resistance, so you must deal win damage. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Okay, this turn I will uh, Lauren will deal wind damage to seal Hexas West Fury. Okay.
Oke, okay, um, Asura's previous attack ya yeah, was terrified, electrified uh, aqua stance. So this turn we should deal lightning or water damage. So. Hmm. I will dispel and cure aja. Okay. This turn, Garnet will evoke anima to deal dark damage also so I accomplish all, all the missions and okay Um, this turn we should um, I will dispel and then one unit guarded Lauren will break okay Okay, we pass uh, the threshold, twenty percent threshold. Um, can I make it? I'm up. Okay, done. So, um, well, I can say that Elena is really, really um, powerful hybrid unit. So that is uh, my strategy to beat uh, Asura with two Elena as my main DPS. I hope you guys uh, can inspire, can be inspired through this video. I hope you guys enjoy your game, and and of course I I hope you can beat uh, Asura easily. So see you on my next video. Uh, once again, I thank you so much for watching my video.